In fall of 2009, 16-year-old Chicago high school student Darian Albert was caught in the crossfire of gang violence on his way home from school. I wrote to President and the Secretary of Education that this needs to be corrected with nonviolent methods and teaching of nonviolence in the schools. They encouraged my project and we launched this program for American Institute of Sindhology, teachings of Gandhi, Martin Luther King, Nelson Mandela, Frontier Gandhi, and Aung San Kui. The Institute is launching a community-based nonviolence pilot program in the Chicago suburb of Evanston, Illinois, an economically and racially diverse community of about 65,000 residents. As a community, we should endorse and embrace an atmosphere of peaceful dialogue and nonviolence, even in our disagreements. We should teach our children that the answer to someone being mean to you isn't to be mean back, but instead to approach the problem with an open mind and understanding. That resolution should be the goal. We need to embrace this philosophy at every level. The Evanston Initiative is pushing for a cultural change by reaching out to teachers, parents, and young school-aged children. The idea is to stop the bullying and shooting way before it happens by opening young hearts and minds to the bigger world through education and travel. The Evanston Police Department and the Evanston Township High School are highly invested in restorative justice and peace circles, which allows the airing of disputes in a resolution without violence. I think this is a critical first step. I think it's critical that the adults of the community become engaged with the youth and discuss these significant issues over and over and over again. These conversations are not like vaccines. They have to be revisited frequently and reinforced.